Hello everyone, welcome back and you are watching Technical World. If you try to take a backup of your WhatsApp in your iPhone and the iPhone says cannot complete backup, make sure your phone has an internet connection and that you have enough free space in iCloud. So without wasting any time, let's get started to fix this issue. Now what we have to do, we have to launch settings, tap on your profile icon and tap iCloud. Under iCloud, we have to make sure that iCloud Drive is unable and also WhatsApp is unable under iCloud. If it's already unable, then disable WhatsApp and unable again. That if you're still facing the same issue, then go back to Apple ID, tap on sign out, put Apple ID password, follow the instruction and sign out from apple id now force close all the app that are running in the background and force restart your iphone by quickly press and release volume up button quickly press and release volume down button and press side button until you get apple logo and also depend on your iphone model to force restart after the force restart launch settings and sign in back to apple id Next, launch settings profile icon icloud and turn off the iCloud drive. Here we have to wait for a couple of seconds, then turn on back. Next thing that we have to do, we have to tap on manage storage under iCloud. Check the list, find and tap on WhatsApp Messenger and tap delete. Tap the delete previous backup now try to take the new backup from your WhatsApp. Thing that we have to do, we have to go back to settings, tap on general, tap software update and update your iPhone to a latest iOS version. Then go back to general, tap on transfer reset iPhone, tap reset and tap reset all settings. This process will delete all your customized setting to default setting but no data or media will be deleted. Here we have to Put the iPhone passcode and tap again reset all settings to confirm. That's it. Hopefully friends you found this video helpful so please do like share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.